what is really yoga and how to approach yoga as a beginner when you look at a larger sense yoga is the unity of the energy present in the universe and the energy present within us there are many different ways to say it in you know of individual self and universal self because the word yuj means to unite but there are many different definitions of what yoga is in different textbooks so what do you learn as a yoga practitioner if you're approaching a yoga practice usually if you go to a yoga studio or a yoga school you start with an asana practice which is a very physical um version of this union we are talking about it starts with moving your body loosening up your joints Uh, stretching and strengthening your muscles and uh, making your internal organs be more strong and also be able to perform their task very well so that's how you begin yoga practice uh, many schools start call this a hatha yoga practice where you use your physical body and try to bring awareness in your physical body and then you go into your breath aspect your pranayama practice and then slowly you go into your mental aspect your mind trying to understand the thoughts and why you are confused why there is no clarity and then eventually try to seek the answer who am i you know in the bigger picture so as a beginner this can be a little overwhelming to understand yoga as a whole so it's very good to start with a physical practice if you're looking only for health benefits yoga has amazing health benefits it's a only practice where every movement is combined with a breathing uh, method and um, it will help you to really be fully healthy not just in your physical body like in your muscles or bones but also in internal organs like say your heart your abdomen or your intestines or your kidneys and it's just um a holistic approach towards a practice so once you feel okay now i feel healthy and i have um a lot of things sorted out and then now i want to explore deeper yoga also again gives you a place to delve deep into your practice where you focus on your breath work you are focusing on deepening um your understanding of what breath is and how that is actually converted into a life force inside you and how all the physical functions like your metabolism or your uh, physiological functions takes place like some people say i'm not able to digest better some people feel i can't uh, breathe better some people have difficulty in just standing up because of the pain so all this are not just the physical aspect of your body but also your breath will come into play so yoga will help you to understand in that aspect and now you feel okay now i have a good understanding of what body and breath is and i want to know my thoughts why i am confused why i have so much of emotions and what's what why is this happening to me and then you can approach a meditative approach towards the practice um for the mind but i would say meditation would definitely require you to sit in a place where you are comfortable with your body and your breath so if you don't practice your asanas or pranayama meditation can be a little difficult to access so i would always say start with a physical practice unless even if it's a very simple practice just for 10 minutes 15 minutes start with physical practice and you will be able to go deeper into understanding your thoughts and have a little bit more clarity on what your mind or what you really want and after that slowly when meditation happens um there will, all your bigger questions will be answered through the process so this is um, the motto or like trying to squeeze what yoga is in a 5 minute short video and i hope you enjoy it if you have any questions about this please uh, feel free to message us and in atma yoga shala this is what we try and aim to provide we want yoga accessible to everybody in this world um anybody can approach yoga for what they really want and then slowly go into a practice which will suit them and then finally reach the state where yoga will lead you there you know so come and ask us questions and let us